I've finally checked in and I've packed my suitcase the airport um, is like an hour away and I have to take a train and then a bus the flight leaves at 2.30 um, and yeah I'm gonna get there three hours beforehand because I'm an early babe um, I'm so nervous I feel like an adult I really feel like an adult um, obviously Danielle's in Montreal so we're gonna meet each other in Chicago um, yeah we're gonna meet in Chicago and then after that we'll be together and then we'll land in San Diego so we ate it but we got some Chicago style deep dish pizza so we've officially landed in Chicago we've got one hour till our flight to San Diego and I'm super excited <laughs> with me again yes we are <laughs> this we, is, I think it's like third video yeah She's, yeah, it's our channel. Welcome back to our channel, guys. <laughs> Show them one else. Uh, I think I overpaid, but it's fine. I'm going to do it like this. My name is Chris Sui, and you're watching Disney Channel. Bam, 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 bam. Woo! Woo! Hello, everyone. We are officially in San Diego, California. We've made it. Wow. We made wow. it last night. We made it last night and we are well rested and now we're going to Target. Yeah, we're going to Target. Um, yeah, we're at my uncle's for the next six days and we're going to have a good time. Yeah, yeah. Okay guys, so is there anything to show where we are? Taco Bell. I would give. I got, I got a chicken quesadilla. Not a chicken quesadilla. I got a steak quesadilla, a taco, um, and fries. I would give it a six. Oh, yeah. The, the quesadilla was great. The tacos. I got the classic combo and I got nacho fries, the big burrito. Maybe like a six. The taco was like a three or a four. Um, I had the cinnamon twist, like a five. And then not two fries, though. like a solid eight, eight and a half. Was a and I had a Baja Blast because when I was younger, every single YouTuber had this drink. But I got the zero sugar one because like they show the calories next to food. <laughs> like the normal Baja Blast one. I couldn't justify buying it. So I was like, let's get zero sugar. So I enjoyed the first half. The first half was okay. The second half of the drink, I don't know what's wrong. So we won't be back, unfortunately. 
Um, it's definitely still better than the one in London, which is saying a lot, which is quite scary. Taco Bell, no thank you. But you're good for the experience. Yeah. Also, I just want to say this is a large. I don't. It's scary. Why? <laughs> this is this is scary. Very scary. Target. Target haul. I don't know. We also we spent like. <sighs> so we got insect repellent off lotion. Um, I use this in the Philippines actually. Like it works. So it's certified. Yeah, I've used it. But because we're going on a hike tomorrow, and obviously we're gonna wear shorts, so we're not gonna get bit. Um, I also bought spray on sunblock because it's very important. Yes. Um, what's it again? We were basically just going through the aisles and like seeing what was interesting, and <laughs> this was interesting. Yeah. It's it's a cracker and you dip it in cheese. Oh, um, that's a good snack. Or goldfish. Apparently, that is also a good snack. It was only ninety nine cents, and it looked like a milk carton. I thought it was really fascinating. That was fun. And then I'm so excited for this one, but I think that I'm not hungry enough to try it. And yeah. We got Java chip Oreos. Yum. Yum. I like it in my Starbucks cappuccino. I'm gonna do my I'll do lingo because I'm on 69 days because I'm learning French. Let's even have it up. up. Francais. Ta mère est française. Did you hear that? That means I'm correct. <laughs> she got um, French GCSE, so she should. I got an eight. Okay, translate this. <laughs> Elle sent contente. She's happy. Yeah. Contente, contente. As you can see, obviously, this is very <laughs> easy. <laughs> but that's because some of us are beginners here, okay? Some of us are learning. But we didn't actually. <laughs> so I was sat at the very back of the plane in the, the corner window seat. And two, the next two rows in front of me, and all of that side were maybe still <laughs> And it was funny because we were talking about this earlier because we were because they were clapping for them and we were like, oh, this is this is so new to us. We've never seen this before because yeah. I haven't. I don't even think I've seen the military in the UK. I mean, I've never. I've never seen the army. Not that many as well. There was like a good ten of them. 10 plus exactly and so danielle called it she actually was i was like it'll be really funny if i was like to christy it'll be really funny if you ended up in between them yeah. danielle's surrounded by soldiers he was showing me like a full hour it was a full hour documentary but we don't watch an entire thing but it was on his phone because we because we don't have tv on united airlines united airlines get with the time that's zero out of ten behavior 100 four hour and a half flight no tv no food what you thought. <sighs> that was our target haul and the next thing will be us on a hike at 6 a.m. I haven't woken up in 6 a.m. in quite a while. 4 6 a.m. Are you serious? Yeah. Like, even with my 8 a.m. classes, I usually just miss them. You know, I feel like if someone was to meet you, they'd feel like you're a morning person. Really? Yeah. Obviously, Comment I'm... down below. <laughs> Comment down below. <laughs> you feel like you're a morning person. Good morning. Good morning. Today we're giving a hiker call. Yeah. It's 6 something a.m. And yeah, we're doing a morning hike. We're in Torrey Pines today and we plan to take the Guy Fleming Trail, I think. Yeah. Um, apparently it's really good for sports. And then... Then we're going to go to La Jolla for lunch. Yep. Yeah. Okay, we've officially reached the trail. The guy filming trails, so the hike starts now. Hiker era starts now. Take us in. <gasps> Take us in. And then we went out to eat, and now we're in our kayaking era. <laughs> Wait on it. Yeah. Are you still nervous? Like, why we talk about it? <laughs> this is just so funny because I just didn't expect. I really yeah. thought you'd be less nervous than this. Genuinely. But you know what? I'm less nervous than I was in the Starbucks. 
Yeah, yeah. You, you what? <laughs> I was really nervous. I was really referring to yesterday. Oh, Danielle's okay, been, okay. since yesterday, she's been, hmm, hmm, kayaking. But the other thing is, I hate trying things for the first time. I don't like trying new things. But that's the only way you grow. Even though right? she's the one that flipped off. Yeah, we fell, we fell in and actually, <laughs> I couldn't, I, I couldn't do it anymore. I couldn't, I couldn't. I just couldn't, I couldn't complete that. It was very scary. <laughs> <Do you know laughs> it was very scary. Because Chris did be like, what well, Chris did was, she it's still and floated. But the thing is, if she kept floating, she would have been pushed further back. So I had to hold her. But the advice that people give is not to panic. So I froze in order to survive. That was my survival instincts. That was survival instincts kicking in. And Danielle just, just holding onto my hand. And she was like, Chris did be, Chris be. I was just so excited. And the thing is, we could stand up. <laughs> But the thing is, I kept on saying, how? How does one stand as if I'm on ground? Yeah, I stood up. <laughs> the minute she was like, you can stand, I stood up. I was like, but how? Because <laughs> mentally, I was like, how should I stand? <laughs> but if, really, if you kept floating and I didn't grab onto you, you really would have ended up... <laughs> that means the advice that's been given to people... Actually, the lesson is, you know what, let me not even justify it. The lesson is, learn how to swim. <laughs> that's the lesson. The lesson is, learn how to swim. Learn how to swim. <laughs> Hey guys, I got a beer. I got a twisted. I forgot what I got. Twisted lap. Twisted, twisted tea. Twisted tea. It's like beer, but it tastes like iced tea. Okay. And I didn't want to pay fifteen dollars for a drink. I got a margarita. As a slush. As a slush. Isn't this just lovely, guys? So now we're eating um, and drinking because it's well deserved. I'm traumatized. My hair is wet. <laughs> No, I'm not even joking, guys. That was so scary. <laughs> that was so scary. We're doing a fit check. So, my hair... <laughs> my hair is from Amazon. My necklaces are from Congo. My besties um, thrifted. Bracelets thrifted. Congo. San Diego Zoo. This shirt thrifted. This dress. Pretty little thing. This bag. Amazon. These shoes! Converse. A dress is from Urban. Yeah. My jacket is actually my granddad he gave it to me, but I think it's from Big Gap. Up. My shades are from Tommy Hilfiger. Handbag is thrifted. Digital camera and my shoes. Are Tell them. Are from a Miri. A <laughs> But yeah, these are our fits. I'm so glad to see you. You guys are only sleeping lately. Uh, okay. I know I said this. Because you and the pizza were my favorite. And Daniel already knows I'm not a fan of the zoos. Like I'm not a fan of the zoos. Hopefully so. But, but like, that one was really good. And I think they even know, because they were emphasizing in the tour, like how much work they do outside of just like mm. basically, it's not just about them like keeping animals in the zoo for people to watch. Like they do help the endangered animals and they, you know, do the. They'll do a lot of conservation work, a lot of rescue work, a lot of yeah. um, breeding as well. There's a lot of endangered animals in there. Literally. And we were looking for pandas and they literally gave they the pandas them. back to the wild. I literally so. came to this, I was so excited because I heard the San Diego um, Zoo was one of the zoos, in the, one of the few zoos in the world that actually had great giant pandas, but they released them. Yeah, they released them. <laughs> Which is good. Which is nice. It's good. It's so ethical of them. <laughs> um, you see how much they care because some of the animals weren't there. They were actually yeah. taken to like a safari park um, or the actual um, centers. It's a good vibe. Nothing special, oh. but I can eat it. Just finished our Jack in the Box meal. I would give my cheeseburger a 8 out of 10. I would get it again, but there are cheap alternatives. I'd rate this Pineapple Express with Red Bull. 10 out of 10. It's great. Um, fries. I really like the party pie. <laughs> I feel like standard pie, they were good. 7 out of 10. Altogether, tacos, 4 out of 10 for me personally. But they were like 2 for a dollar fifty, which is like crazy. Fair, good, yeah, good money. Altogether, I would rate Jack in the Box. 6 out of 10.
I got the jumbo cheese with like curly fries. I really liked it. 8.5 generally. Um, Red Bull, I'd say 8. 8, 9. Um, I got mine unsweetened and it's already really sweet still. Um, tacos, I agree. Maybe a 5. But the price point is really good. Like, he was saying. Which is also, I appreciate you so much for that. I think. <laughs> Peer pressure works! Yeah. For someone that's so like introvert, you do like to go outside, just outside the country. <laughs> <laughs> that's what it is. You just like to go outside the country. That's true. Which I don't, like, I don't think I'm, I don't like stepping out of my comfort zone. I like staying. That's just, something that I realized. Like, you really did try a lot of new things. Yeah, I stayed where I just like staying. But I really like the fact that I traveled. I feel like now I want it. I'm more open to doing it more. Like, I have the goals to actually do it. Mm. Hi, vlog! Chris to Yeah. So, um, we haven't made a sand castle in like how many years? So, Chris to be is. I thought Chris has to go get some wet like, sand. So, you can go, go watch her. Um, you like her. How do I zoom on this? I got it. Oh, I'm zooming! Okay. So, here's Chris to be being a beach be breezy right now, so I'm like kind of cold. <laughs> Their context, we're both terrified of heights. Yeah. This is this is not our bag. This is not our, thing. This is not our bag. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Chris to be prayed so many times during that ride. You better come on now. <laughs> come on. <laughs> oh good. You gotta get funnel cake. Yeah. You get funnel cake. Funnel cake. Um, apparently, I have to try this in this side of the world. So we're trying it. Spain or San Diego? Answer the question. Comment down below. Comment down below. <laughs> Guys, Danielle's basically taught me how to use this camera properly. I haven't been using this camera the way it's supposed to be because look at... She has, she's, she, has, she hasn't been using every single pound. I, exactly. I invested so much money into this and look what I'm doing. I'm just using simple, simple effects. I should be rinsing every filter out here and I'm not. I would minus seven. Just because I didn't like the rest of my food. But everything else is great. I really like certain parts of my world, but not everything about it. So I give it a seven. I found the restaurant on the Big Pool. Michelin Big Pool Mart. Guys, no one, not a lot of people know about that, I realize. Yeah, Look at that, everyone. So it's basically like, you guys have Michelin stars, right? Michelin Big and that's used to like, a lot of people associate Michelin stars with like fine dining. So for all the people like me, I can't afford a mission to restaurant yet. One day, but not yet. Bipkoman is more like an affordable kind of, a reasonable price. So, I can afford a Bipkoman. That's how I think about it. And it's still Michelin. It's a, it's a certain award. And this restaurant got a Michelin Bipkoman award. It's a 
That was a lesson from Daniel. <laughs> Together. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, <laughs> Daniel, please. <laughs> please. Please. Okay. Three, two, one, go. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Three, two, one, go. Ooh, oh, yeah. That's great. See? And I'll take that and that's perfect. <laughs> Ooh, oh, yeah. It's very pretty here. Mm -hmm. We are resting where many celebrities have rested. So it's only natural that we also rest here. Bit of history. The um, hotel behind us was built in 1888. Um, so it survived many, many years. Um, notable guests, Charlie Chaplin, um, Marilyn Monroe, a lot of US presidents, um, one king of Hawaii. Mm -hmm. um, Whoopi Goldberg. Whoopi Goldberg, yep. Brad Pitt, Madonna. A lot of famous people. Yeah, very and now us. <laughs> We're just sitting in front of a bench. But it's very pretty. Um, episode um, one will be San Diego, episode two will be LA, and then episode three will be the universe. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I've already I've got my editing ideas in this brain, and I just hope it's executed on the camera. <laughs> Transition! <laughs> Oh, you know I'm gonna be okay, okay.